Welcome to part 6 of the Contact 3 video tutorials. In previous videos, we've touched on some of the features new to Contact 3. Continuing in this vein, the ability to work with tempo synced sample material has been enhanced and simplified. Let's take a look. If you've ever worked with sampled rhythmic material, such as a drum loop, you've probably found that the loop rarely matches the tempo of the song you want to use it in. There are a number of ways to fix this, and one of them is slicing. Slicing breaks a loop up into individual rhythmic pieces, each of which can be triggered independently, allowing the loop to smoothly respond to tempo changes. Slicing in Contact 3 begins by turning on the grid. The easiest way to get usable slices is to have Contact do it for you. By changing the slice threshold, Contact will automatically identify ideal places to slice the loop based on the rhythms in the sample. Once the slice points have been identified, clicking Use Beat Machine will cause Contact to treat the slices as individual samples that will now respond to tempo change. Slicing a loop in Contact 3 has other benefits that go beyond mere tempo shifting. Slices can be independently processed for additive creative effect. By selecting a given slice and choosing Reverse, for example, only the selected slice will be reversed. You don't have to stop here. Instead of triggering the entire loop by holding a key down, you can break out all the slices so that each slice can be triggered by its own MIDI note. Here you can see each slice of the loop on its own key, and each slice can be played individually. As you can hear, it's like playing a drum machine whose sounds have been built exclusively from our audio loop. What's more, by clicking drag and drop MIDI, you can create a MIDI sequence that will automatically trigger each of the different slices in the loop. You can then import this file into any MIDI sequencer, or you can even drag and drop the file directly onto a track in a sequencer application. From there you could perform any number of creative maneuvers, such as rearranging the MIDI notes in the sequencer to trigger the slices in a different order. To see even more creative possibilities, check out the next video on one of Contact 3's most powerful new features, Zone Envelopes.